Hi and welcome back. Optimizing a ME crossover strategy. Optimization is the process of finding most suitable strategy parameters. Now left now let us refer back the code we used for backtesting an MA crossover strategy. We backtested the strategy with parameters 5 and 20. It means the fast moving average was calculated over 5 intervals and the slow moving average was calculated over 20 intervals. These parameters gave us a marginal profit of 1060. However, if we would have used moving averages with period 10 and 20, then the result would have been different. For parameters 20 and 30, the result will again be different. So in order to find the best parameters, we need to run all these vectors and see which parameters are most profitable. In the strategy optimization code, I have removed all lines of code used for calculating backtesting matrix or plotting the chart. We just need on bus to define the strategy rules on enter OK and on exit OK. Instead of using two parameters, I define two lists for both the parameters. The iter tools product is used to find all possible permutations from these two lists of parameters. The list for fast moving average has 6 parameters and the list for slow moving average also has 6 parameters. So we need to run 36 backtests. To run a large number of backtests faster, we use parallel computing. The PyAlgo trade local optimizer executes many instances of a strategy in parallel to find the parameters that yield the best results. Excellent. So let us run this optimizer code. The optimizer code uses parallel computing, so note the hike in the CPU usage. The best results comes with parameters 30 and 40. They give us a return of 33%. We can run again our backtesting code with this set of parameters. Let us try that. You see, with parameters 30 and 40, it is a smooth equity curve. It also gives a great sharp ratio of 2.26. Now if we try to treat like this strategy with parameters 30 and 40, we will be doing overfitting. Our plain vanilla backtest was underfitted. And right now, cherry picking the best parameters will make the strategy overfitted. What we need is a robust set of parameters not overfitted parameters. We will see later how to find a set of robust fitting parameters. Thank you for attentively listening to this lecture. In the next lecture, we will try to optimize different set of trading strategies.